Fleming's left hand rule. In the earlier section, we studied about a motor. But how can we determine in which direction will this motor rotate? If direction of magnetic field and current is given. We will discuss one rule, the Fleming's left hand rule, on the basis of which we can find the direction of force. The rotating direction of armature coil for the given direction of magnetic field and current. According to this rule, if you arrange your left hand in such a way that your thumb, first finger and second finger all point at right angles to one another and if your first finger is pointing in the direction of the magnetic field, second finger is pointing towards the direction of current, then the thumb will give you the direction of the force. Let us check out the left hand rule once more against the animation. Have you understood the rule? No? Okay. Now let's understand this by taking a simple circuit. Now arrange your left hand with thumb, first finger and second finger all pointing at right angles to one another. Now point your first finger in the direction of the magnetic field. Point your second finger in the direction of current. According to Fleming's left hand rule, the thumb will give the direction of force. In this case, the conductor will experience a force in upward direction or it will move up. Now, can you guess in which direction the conductor will experience a force if we reverse the direction of current? <laughs>